you said you wanted more from your Mixcast 4. Well, Tascam listened and delivered. So, what's new in the Mixcast 4's version 1.20 firmware update? For starters, now users can add vocal effects on as many as four microphone inputs. By entering the effect settings screen, we can switch the mode from channel, meaning an individual mic, to common, which is shared by all mic inputs. Effects can be turned off and on for those individual mics on the home screen by tapping the sound wave icon at the top of each channel. The ducking effect can now be used to impact pad playback sounds. When signal comes into mic channel one, ducking dips the levels of all the other channels around that one. From the mic one voice setting screen, turn on the with pad switch to enable ducking of the sound pads. An input gain adjustment feature has been added to the USB, smartphone, and Bluetooth channels, making it easier than ever to achieve suitable volume levels. Enter the level screen for one of those options. We're using USB here, but the smartphone and Bluetooth screens are the same. Adjusting the input gain so that the peak stays in the orange range on the meter allows for optimal levels. In addition to all that, tweaks have been made to the feedback prevention setting. Enter the hardware settings menu, then audio settings. Tapping on next to feedback prevention enables this feature. If monitors are being used while recording, microphones will be cut from the speakers while this function is active, allowing for more clarity while producing content. The mute icon will be shown on the home screen when this function is enabled. Knowing exactly what levels your channels are hitting while monitoring is important. Now users have the option of enabling a decibel meter. Enter the hardware settings menu, then advanced settings. Tap on to enable the feature. We can now see the decibel readout on the home screen. This function can also be turned off or on by tapping the meter area on the home screen. And finally, a shortcut function has been added that jumps to settings screens by tapping the channel numbers and input icons on the home screen. Thanks for watching. We hope you're enjoying creating amazing content with the Mixcast 4. Don't forget to click subscribe at the bottom of the screen to be notified when we post new videos.